Many of you guys have asked me what to do on a losing streak. There's always a different reason for each person, but I can still give you five reasons why you might be underperforming or struggling in game. Hey guys, salut mes amis, ok, hallo gebar, Maxime here. To begin, I just want to say that changing mouse sensitivity, graphic settings, and other smaller tweaks similar to that is probably not the issue. It's usually related to your playstyle and decision making. Oh, and cheaters as well. But let's ignore them for this video. This is about you. The first reason, and probably the main reason, is because you're tired and you can't focus through the whole game because you're tilted. The problem with playing a game and losing it is very often that you want to play more right after, and you don't give yourself enough time to rest. The solution is to obviously rest or even take a break for a couple days. I know how hard it is to let go of the game when it's going bad because you really want to prove that you're better, but try to find a good balance that works for you and take a break. The second reason could be that you need to refresh your aim. By that, I mean that you should probably look at your hand movement while shooting, especially with pistols or when you're tapping. The game will always reward players with straight aim. This is not wanted, you can't curve your bullets. The less shaky your aim is, the more shots you will land. So the solution is, stop shaking when shooting, easier said than done. But seriously, practice your aim helps. The third reason might be that you're wide peeking just a little too much. This could very well be that you're losing patience because you're not calm after dying several rounds in a row. The more you die, the more of a test it will be to see if you can stay calm, peak at a normal level, and be disciplined. There are moments when wide peeking is good, especially if you want quick info. But a perfect game of Counter-Strike is to clear every angle carefully unless you know for sure that no one's there. The fourth reason could also be that you're doing the same thing over and over again. Imagine you're the enemy. If you know that someone is playing from the same position each round, you could exploit it to your advantage. So let's say you change position on the site, but it's still going bad. The reason could also be that you're engaging the enemy wrong. But you can always switch with another player to hold the other site or move to another area. Just make sure you learn a couple sweet spots on the map so you have different options. I also strongly suggest that you watch other people play to get ideas on how you can improve. You will always find small tricks that streamers, pros, and YouTubers like to do. The fifth and last reason might be that you need to fresh up your gaming environment. I like to clean my setup at least once every week where it will just start to get filthy, especially on the keyboard and mouse. The results are very noticeable. I cough less, I also sneeze less, even though I can still get allergic reactions, and I also just feel happier overall. If you have many cans of soda or energy drinks, get rid of them. They shouldn't be on your desk. It's also nice to clean up plates or mugs or things you normally shouldn't have on your desk. It will feel much better, I promise. I hope you received some helpful information here, and if you want to talk about getting back to your top level in CSGO, you can get some helpful advice on Discord if you want, and talk to other people there. If you want to add any comments or advice down below, you can obviously do that. Comments like, the reason why you're underperforming is because you're not using cheats, um, those are watermelons by the way. That's it for this video. Hope you enjoyed it, I'll see you guys in the next one, and go bananas.